What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred back again with another Pokemon Go news update video. Today is April 17th, 2018. And as you can tell on screen, Niantic has 100% confirmed that Charmander is indeed going to be the Pokemon Go Community Day Pokemon for the month of May. Now, yesterday I did a video reporting on this. Basically, it was kind of leaked out early on the Japanese Pokemon Go website that Charmander was indeed going to be the Pokemon Go Community Day Pokemon for the month of May. But because of the wording and a lot of PokeTubers scared to kind of cover it because it wasn't officially announced worldwide and on Niantic's website, on their blog site, on the event page, which I am on, and I'm going to have the link to this event page in the description below so you guys can check it out yourselves. Yeah, Charmander is going to be the May exclusive Pokemon for Pokemon Go. So what is that also coming with? Like always, it does come with an exclusive move. Like always, we don't know the move. The move is gonna be not for Charmander, but for his evolutionary stage of Charizard when Charmeleon evolves into Charizard within the three hour window. Now you're gonna be able to get three times catch Stardust. So when you catch a Pokemon, you're gonna get three times a Stardust within that window of Pokemon Go community day as well as three hour lures going on which is dope one thing you do need to take notice is that they moved the day back to saturday so th this pokemon go community day is going to be happening on may 19th check your local listings for pacific times that the uh, community day is going to run out here in europe which i'm going to be back out here in switzerland by may 19th it's going to be from 11 a.m to 2 p.m that's the normal time if you guys want to link up with me and if you out here in Switzerland, let me know in the comments section below or hit me up on Instagram or Twitter. Now, I've seen a lot of mixed reactions from a, a yesterday's video where people were saying like, that's another reason why it may be fake because why would they go back on the date when Sunday was so much better? Now, that might be for you, but for other people, Saturday might be better for Pokemon Go Community Day. And I think that's what they're doing. They want all of the audience, everyone to have a chance where it's more comfortable and convenient for them. So this is just, to me, a play on uh, trying to make it okay and comfortable for everyone. I think we just need to be glad that they're not doing Pokemon Go Community Day in the middle of the week, and that would be, that would kind of suck for everyone. So I'm glad that they're sticking to the Saturday and Sunday and kind of rotating it. It looks like they're rotating it every two Pokemon Go Community Days, every two months. So that's pretty cool. That's kind of a way you can kind of gauge it, I guess. With Charmander being the Pokemon Go Community Day Pokemon, I'm super excited. Charmander, one of my favorite Pokemon. It was my, technically my first Pokemon because that was my first starter Pokemon I ever chose was Charmander. So there is that attachment that I have to Charmander. And also the possibility of us getting the shiny version of Charmander in Pokemon Go. Now the shiny sprites for Charmander are in the game. I'm gonna bring them up so you can see how it looks. It's kind of a lightish versus the normal color of Charmander. I kind of like the normal better than the shiny version of Charmander, but it doesn't mean anything because you're gonna have shiny Charmander, you're gonna evolve shiny Charmander into a shiny Charmeleon. This is what shiny Charmeleon looks like. Again, I kind of prefer that dark red Charmeleon. It looks so like almost evilish, like, it, like it's about to be an evil dragon because that's what it is. But when it comes to shiny Pokemon and best looking shiny Pokemon, Charizard takes the cake. Now, this is obviously not the sprite of shiny Charizard inside of Pokemon Go. As of right now, there isn't a official shiny Charizard sprite inside of the game. So that's why I'm just using, um, I believe this is official art from Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. I could be wrong, but this is Charizard's shiny sprite. It's a quote unquote, I say purple. A lot of people say, no, it's just dark black. That's just the, the lighting in this image or whatever the case may be. With the red wings, 
it looks badass it's definitely the most notable shiny pokemon ever it just it looks so good it looks so clean it looks it looks good in ultra sun and ultra moon when you pull that baby out of the pokeball i'm blessed enough to have a few of these in my poke bank so the fact that it i'm going to be able to potentially have the opportunity to catch one inside of pokemon go i'm pretty excited to have that on my phone and you know have a badass shiny charizard on my team now that is the thing i've been having okay luck with shinies and then not okay luck i didn't catch any shiny dratini during the three hours of pokemon go community day am i bummed out for the i didn't get green dragonite not really I did happen to get three Murkip or Murkeep or whatever, however you call that fucking sheep. I got three of those cotton candy babies, which I'm totally psyched for because, again, I'm trying to get a complete living dex in my Pokemon Go game and a shiny living dex would be even better. But that's just a long term goal for, for me. So hopefully I am able to capture three shiny Charmander so I can just have that and have one shiny as Charmander, have one shiny as Charmeleon, and have one shiny as Charizard. Now, again, guys, we do not know the exclusive move, so I am asking you in the comment section below, what do you think the exclusive move is gonna be for Charizard? I'm hoping for something badass and not something like flying, a flying move or something. I'm hoping for a, you know, again, a strong ass fire move to make it the most dominant fire Pokemon inside of Pokemon Go. But let me know your thoughts on what move Charizard should be getting and your thoughts on possibility of you adding a shiny Charmander to your game. Now, let me know what you think about all this in the comment section below. Like always, guys, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on Instagram and Twitter, and you can bring the conversation there. I'm the American Gamer in Switzerland right here on YouTube, and yes, I'm gonna be doing a ton of these Pokemon Go news update videos. The best place to catch them all is with a subscription, so please hit that subscribe button. Also, hit that bell so you can be notified on the next time I drop a video. Peace. I'm gonna see you guys on the next Pokemon Go news update video. And let's all enjoy Pokemon. That's my old catchphrase. And uh, somehow, somehow I lost that, but I still want that message to, to kind of go. There was a lot of negativity over the last couple of days about Pokemon Go and Pokemon Go YouTubers and stuff like that. Let's just all enjoy Pokemon. <laughs> let's just enjoy it.